Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to the Murdoch DeFi YouTube channel. And I wanted to make this quick video on Navy SEAL game because it is set to launch very, very soon here at 5.30 p.m. UTC time today. So I want to talk a little bit about what they've done since we made the last video in preparation for their mint today. Uh, their community has kind of blown up. They have a lot of big things going on. So I just wanted to be able to recap a little bit about the Navy SEAL game uh, in today's video, preparing for their mint today at 5.30 p.m. UTC time. Uh, however, before we jump into today's video, guys, please make sure you do subscribe to the YouTube channel here. If you are new here to the channel, welcome. Uh, if you want to continue to see videos as it pertains to new projects in the crypto and DeFi space, then definitely consider subscribing and hitting the notification bell because just like today's video, the majority of the content that I post here is all very time sensitive. That being said, uh, also the best way to stay up to date with what I'm doing in the world of crypto and DeFi is going to be the premium Discord server. First link to that will be in the description below, right? So moving into the Navy SEAL game, uh, before we talk about this, I do want to mention that these guys are KYC by Assure DeFi. So this is all good stuff here. You can see that they have their little NFT here, uh, which is good to see. The Navy SEAL game is a new risk to earn NFT game on the AVAX blockchain inspired by the world famous video game Counter-Strike. Terrorists are planning attack in the US with TNT. Uh, will Navy SEALs be able to stop them? We choose to play in the terrorist team and succeed to run away with your TNT or will you choose to play in the Navy SEAL game to capture the terrorist and seize the TNT they produced? Uh, so pretty cool to see that they have gone ahead and done their KYC. And really like the the big reasons why I, you know, why I like Navy SEAL game is for one, they have a very long-term vision in mind for, for the actual players, investors of the game. Uh, they have like a series of new tokenomics that hopefully allow this game to survive longer than, you know, its predecessors like Wolf Game and, and uh, Police and Thief or Pizza Game or things like that. And those are all those are all play to earn games where people were earning like upwards of a thousand dollars per day, an absolutely insane amount of return that you could be made. Uh, and like I said, this is, this game has been developing quite the hype. Uh, if we actually look over here on their Twitter, they're looking at almost 7.5 K followers, uh, just since we you know made the video about them a, a couple of days ago. So lots and lots of growth, um, not only on their Twitter, but on their discord as well. So, and then, and, and then like the, the overall storyline behind this, uh, and how they're incorpor incorporating like Trump, um, and the terrorists and the Navy SEALs. Um, so pretty cool. I know that the team has been working pretty hard on this for, for like the last three months. Um, so th those, those factors really like for me, what spoke to me is, is really like the tokenomics and, and how that makes it different. Right. So looking at their homepage here now, you'll be able to choose your characters. Here's, um, Terrorists are hiding everywhere around the country and making bombs with TNT. The brave Navy SEALs were deployed in order to an order of the POTUS, which is Trump here. And you are looking everywhere for the hideouts of the terrorists to catch them before they blow up everything. Will you play the terrorist team and succeed to run away with your TNT? Or will you play the Navy SEAL team to capture the terrorists and seize all their TNT they have produced? When minting, you have a 90% chance of minting a terrorist NFT. Uh, and then a 9% chance of minting a Navy SEAL uh, and a 1% chance of minting the POTUS or like the, the Trump NFT, right? Uh, so if you want a more detailed breakdown of their actual tokenomics and how all this stuff works, I went fully in depth on my last video about them. Uh, so definitely check this, check that out. I will link that in the cards in the upper right hand corner of your screen. Uh, so that way you could check that out. Uh, to mint, when the minting is live, you'll just go to this page here, connect your wallet, and you'll be able to mint. As you can see, pre-sale starts at 5.30 p.m. UTC, and then the public sale starts just 30 minutes later at 6 p.m. UTC time today, April 10th. And a lot of these other portions on the website um, are obviously not active yet because the minting hasn't started yet, but... Uh, we just went to the mint page and then this is where this page here is where you'll be able to mint, um, you know, with the with the TNT that you've earned um, here. When you click on play the game, this is where you'll be able to stake your NFTs. Uh, and once you stake them, they'll start earning that TNT. 
Uh, so pretty cool to see there. If you come back to the menu here, you'll be able to see a leaderboard as well, which is cool. I love the fact that they're incorporating this because people like to be competitive. Uh, you, you will have your armory upgrades too. Again, if you want um, more in-depth knowledge on exactly everything here, you could be able to look at their white paper to really get a good understanding of what each NFT does in particular and the benefits of having, like for instance, a Navy SEAL versus a terrorist and um, obviously this 1% chance of minting the POTUS NFT, which will be huge and it has massive benefits within the actual game with no risk, right? So pretty cool. And this is a risk to earn game, uh, meaning that some of your NFTs can be taken and uh, there's, there's, there's a bunch of different ways to, uh, to kind of strategize and go about this. Uh, I imagine that these NFTs will probably be doing pretty well on the secondary market as well. So it's all good to see. And remember that they have a tax in place where um, essentially any any uh, anybody that's trying to kind of game the system and just play the price action of the TNT token are gonna be taxed 50%. So they have a function within their contract that makes sure that the TNT that you're claiming is coming from within the game and not being purchased on the secondary. Uh, and if you're trying to take profits or, or selling any of the TNT tokens that you've purchased directly from um, like directly from the decks, then you're going to be mint or they, you're going to be taxed 50 percent. And that all is a deflationary measure, um, again, against people that are trying to game the system, so to speak. So I love that fact of Navy SEAL game. So to kind of recap the the white paper, since I know that there's quite a lot of information here, uh, and if you don't want to watch that other video where I kind of went into to depth uh, going through the white paper, uh, essentially there's three different types of NFTs. So you have your terrorist, again, 90% chance. You have your Navy SEALs, uh, that 9% chance, and then you have the POTUS or the President or Trump NFT. There's a 1% chance to mint there. There is a 30% claim tax. They have the time decreasing risk option to essentially give you like give you guys riskier choices uh, from 50% to 10% to lose all of your rewards. So big risk equals big rewards. Um, and there's many ways that you can play this game, right? So implementing, they're also implementing a 1% chance to have your terrorists killed by the Navy SEALs when you unstake it uh, and if it is killed, then the NFT will be burned. Uh, another deflationary mechanic as well. They have, like I was, tr like I was explaining, they have a 50% sale tax for whales, bots, and people who only do speculative trading and don't actually play the game. Um, so people that are trying to essentially pump and dump the the token. Uh, so that is a, a kind of a brief rundown of the the actual mechanics within the game, as simplified as I can make them. Uh, but yeah. And here is a more kind of in-depth view of the actual um, kind of like launch timeline. Uh, so today, April the 10th, they have their mint launch. Again, the pre-sale price is a one AVAX. The public price is 1.3 AVAX to mint one of these NFTs. This is at 5.30 PM today for the pre-sellers and then 6.30, uh, sorry, 6 o'clock p.m. UTC for the public sale. Uh, on the 12th, they will reveal the NFTs at 6 p.m. UTC time. On April 13th, the game starts, um, and that's going to uh, unlock the staking. Um, they'll be adding liquidity to the TNT token as well. And then they have a pretty cool giveaway uh, on the April the 14th, so $10,000 of airdrop in AVAX to one lucky Gen Zero holder. On the 15th, they have one free Gen 1 NFT airdrop to Gen 0 holders who mint at least five NFTs. So pretty cool stuff to see there. Um, but really, that is going to pretty much cover everything as it pertains to the actual launch, the dates and times, the prices, uh, the links to the website, the NFT contracts, all that stuff. Uh, and as you can see here, the most recent one, uh, the... They just posted this right now, but they're launching in about an hour. So I will try to get this video out as soon as possible. <laughs> and heading over to their Twitter here, you can see that they have this pretty cool video um, done up. Uh, it's pretty hilarious if you want to check it out on their Twitter and, uh, and be able to actually listen to it. But it is cool. You have James Pelton talking about this. 
Uh, he's going to be live streaming the actual mint. Uh, so very, very cool stuff to see. I'm hyped about Navy SEAL game. Let me know what you think about Navy SEAL game down below in the comment section of today's video. I'm going to go ahead and wrap the video here so I can get this out to you guys so you don't miss this mint. Have a great day.